Hey YouTube, this is Chris Minecraft Videos here with another video. Today I'm starting a series, and what I'm going to be doing is a bunch of plugin reviews just on plugins that I feel are great for a server if you're starting a server. So the first plugin I'm going to be talking about is RBD Essentials. I run this on one of my other servers, and I feel it's a great plugin. I would like to show you guys about. It. So first of all. There's a few commands that come with this. So if you type RPG, you have RPG help, which you can navigate through the help pages. You also have slash RPG cape, which you can change your cape in game. You just have to type slash RPG cape, your name, and the URL, but it has to be a .png. And our RPG title, you can change your title in the game slash rpg speed you can change your speed so you can run pretty damn fast so that's a cool thing and you can also change your skin which i think is really cool no more having to go to the website and changing your skin and all that crap all right now here's one very useful command slash rpg space weather and then you have many selections. You could make it thunder, sun, or storm. So let's just make it storm really fast. So yeah, pretty much just starts a storm, which is pretty cool. Slash RPG weather sun. And you'll change it back to sun. Sometimes it takes a little bit to change back to sun, but it it'll change. Yeah, there you go. And now you can change the time too, so slash RPG space time space. This is also works for different worlds, so if you have multiple worlds you can change change the time in a certain world. But I'm not gonna be doing that, so morning, day, afternoon, or night. Let's just change it to nighttime. Wait, hold on. Slash RPG time night. And yeah, so it gets pretty dark. And then I'll change it back. You just type RPG time day, just like that. Okay, let's look. So our RPG heal, you can heal the health of somebody. Their red bar. And yeah, so that's it for the first page. Let's go to RPG help two. So we have RPG feed will fill up your hunger bar to the specified amount. RPG money, this tells you how much money you have. So, right now I have $100, that's what you start out with. You can change this in the config, just like most things. And then RPG, and then NPC create, so you type slash NPC create, space the name you want it to have, so you can do John, space the type. The three types are default, which is a normal NPC, quester, which you can use to create massive quests, it's endless possibilities and banker which I'll show you all of these in a second so here we have Bob he is default he let's see so you just right click hello have a nice day you can change that if you want and we have a quester which I don't have a quest set up you can set this up in quest.yml and here we have a banker so you right click and you can buy more room. I already bought nine slots for zero dollars. Eighteen slots is a hundred dollars. And to access your bank, there's something called a vault, which looks like this. It's a custom block made by the made by this plugin developer. So you just right click it, and I only have nine slots as of now. Okay, so that's it for the NPCs. Now you can use NPC wand, which is fast for selecting, which my inventory is full. So what that does, it gives you a custom item made by the plugin developer, and you can just right click an NPC to select it instead of having to type NPC select into the thing. So that's pretty cool. Um okay, let's look. So we have NPC type you can change the type of an NPC really fast. NPC rename, you can rename the NPC. 
can also change the owner of the NPC so that they have access to that NPC. So let's go to help three for the last little bit of command. So you can type slash NPC remove to remove an NPC. You can also move an NPC without having to recreate him. Change the skin on an NPC. As you can see here, Bob has some kind of dragon snake looking thing, which is pretty cool. You can change the armor, which is pretty sick, so you can give an NPC special armor. So this that's it for the commands. This plugin also comes with many different custom items, which I really like. So here's the anvil. If you've ever played any other type of RPG or MMORPG game, most of them have this. I'm not sure quite what it does yet. I'm not sure if it even does anything, but it looks pretty sick. Here's the bank I already showed you. It's called a vault. This item opens your bank. Now here's all the custom bushes. So here's the white bush, pink bush, light green, dark green, and orange. Those are pretty cool for decorations outside of your house or in your garden. And here's the store, which I think is amazing. Whoever created this, good job. Good, good job. So let's open this up. So this is what it opens. You have, you can buy every item in the game here. So take a look at food here. It'll open up on a screen, and if you can sell items, buy items, whatever you want. So you can buy apple for fifteen dollars. So when you buy it, brings up a little screen here. It says bought an apple. It's another page. Golden apple, bread, cake, raw beef, every food item. Let's buy a cookie. Bought one cookie for fifteen dollars. All right, let's go back. Alright, let's go to mob drops. String, leather, feather, arrow, egg, blah blah blah. It just goes on and on. You can buy anything here. So pretty much that's the story. Buy any items, tells you the price, brings up a little cool screen after you buy something. Now here's the custom ores that come with this plugin. Right here is all of them. It's pretty sick. Right here is the do not continue. I think it's pretty sick, but I haven't found any use for it yet. It's still a good thing to have if you ever want to create blocked off areas. You can just use these blocks so people won't try and bypass or anything. So that's pretty cool. And that's pretty much this plugin. If you have any questions, feel free to comment on this video. I'm always there to answer. Please leave a like if you like this video, subscribe if you want more videos, and to check out the rest of my channel if you haven't. So yeah, thanks and bye.